What is up you guys? I hope you're all doing well. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Samantha and this is my 21, almost 22 week old puppy named Murphy. If you want to know more about him, you can click on the links down below in the description box. I will put some videos down there for you, but wait until after you watch this video because you're going to want to stick around. This vlog is going to be a short but sweet little unboxing vlog. I just want to show you this package that I got from a brand called Happy Dog. It is a raw dog food brand and they specialize in making raw food for dogs and they also specialize in treats. We've been feeding Murphy kibble since he was eight weeks old. He has been eating pottery and he has been on this specific food from that brand and it's like a chicken sweet potato mix and it's really really good for him. I mean it has um, chicken sweet potatoes, broccoli, kale, cranberries, blueberries, and every now and then I would just think, okay, well, what can I give him that I eat myself? So I kind of went down this rabbit hole online of just foods that dogs can eat that humans can also eat. Keep in mind, I know that there are some foods that are toxic to dogs like grapes and chocolate and all of that, but I wanted to see what foods he could eat that would be safe for him and give him some benefits like improving his eyesight, improving his coat. So I learned a lot along the way and if you don't know about this YouTuber, her name is Rachel Fusaro. You can look her up on YouTube. She's a dog trainer and she has all of these videos of diet and what she feeds her dogs, products that she really likes using that she thinks, you know, are really good for her dogs. And I got really inspired by her knowledge and her wisdom and just what she had to say about um, raw food and that type of quality of food that you can give your dogs. And keep in mind, Murphy is still really young, but I am hoping that when he's an adult dog, I can give him raw meat, I can give him raw bones, I can give him raw fish. I wanna learn more about it. So keep in mind, this vlog is not by any means an educational vlog. I'm not trying to tell you what's right or wrong or what you should or should not feed your dog. I am going through my own journey and I just wanna learn as much as possible about the raw food diet, but I do for sure down the road see myself feeding Murphy more raw food. And so this is just an intro to that. I would say like since he was 10 weeks old, I've started incorporating more fruits and vegetables in his diet. He loves broccoli, celery, carrots, um, frozen peas, blueberries, strawberries, some mashed banana with peanut butter in his Kong. Oh my goodness, he loves that. Goat milk, goat milk yogurt, sweet potatoes. I started buying very small sweet potatoes from Trader Joe's and I'll every now and then peel them, roast them, and mash them. And I'll put it in a little pint container and put it in the fridge. That will last a while and every now and then I'll just mix that in his food or give it to him in a Kong, put it on a little licky mat. So I'm just kind of experimenting and trying to see what he likes and what he doesn't like. But so far he's not a picky eater. He'll eat pretty much anything, um, which is really good for me because I find enjoyment in going to the grocery store and getting you know a little bit of organic ground chicken for him and getting some celery for him as well as for us because then it feels good knowing that i'm eating the same thing that he's eating and if i'm benefiting from it then he definitely is as well so anyways just wanted to give you a little introduction as to why i got interested in this brand in the first place let's dive right into this unboxing shall we because this box is just telling me to open it so i'm gonna put murphy down he has a little uh, Chewy Louie. I will link these down below in the description box. Not sponsored, but we truly love these and as you can see he loves them too. So I'm gonna put him down here with the little Chewy Louie so that he is entertained and staying busy while I'm doing this video. All right, I'm excited because I genuinely have no idea what's in this box, but I got it delivered today. So I'm excited to open it. So if you don't know what a raw food diet is, it's pretty much what it sounds like. You can feed your dog only raw meats, bones, and certain vegetables. Um, and it's just not cooked, not processed, no preservatives, no additives, none of that stuff. So, oh my God. Whoa. This is a lot of stuff. Murphy, he's excited. Oh my God. Okay. Wow. I'll just um go one by one and show you guys. I got premium air-dried dog and cat treats. This is a smelt. It says a fresh addition to any bowl. No preservatives or additives. One single ingredient, biologically appropriate, ethically sourced. So this is a two ounce bag. Wow, look at this. It's kind of cool because you can really see the fish skin. You can see the product. It's really great. This is awesome. All treats we offer serve a nutritional purpose for your pets. 
The whole fish supply omega-3s and organ meats supply B vitamins, folic acid, iron, and magnesium. The edible bones provide glucosamine, promote healthy joints, and oral hygiene. Muscle meat is the primary component of a raw diet providing essential protein required for a balanced meal. For additional nutritional information, visit www.happyhappeedawg.com. Wow, you guys. He's never had smelt, but he loves salmon. Like, absolutely loves salmon. So, I'm sure he'll love that too. <gasps> Pork loin, look at this. Murphy, what's that? Oh my goodness, what's that? This is an eight ounce bag of pork loin. Again, you can really see, really see the product in there. Wow, this is really impressive. I love the branding of it. I love how you can actually see what's inside and they really want you to see what you're getting. Um, and this is a pretty hefty amount. Next, we got chicken breast. This is another eight ounce bag premium air dried chicken breast. Look at that, you guys. Very, very cool. Oh my goodness. It says start with feeding a quarter of the treat size. Feed one to three pieces per day. Pets should not consume the whole bag in one day. Not meant for human consumption. Next, we got salmon skin. He is definitely gonna love this. I love, I don't know if you can see, but the oils in here. And last but not least, beef liver. <whistles> ah, my goodness, this is beautiful. This is another eight ounce bag. Just to a recap, we got the eight ounce bag of the chicken breast, an eight ounce bag of the beef liver, and an eight ounce bag of the pork loin, which is definitely gonna last us a while. And I'm super, super pumped to see which products he likes the most because a lot of these are pretty new. He has had dry, air dried beef liver in the past and he loves salmon skin, but the smell, the pork loin, the chicken breast, he's never had that before. And then on top of that, we got one two ounce bag of smelt and one two ounce bag of the salmon skin. So um, if you guys are interested in purchasing these, if you're interested in checking it out or even looking at their website and just wanting to learn more about it, you can go to www.happy, H-A-P-P-E-E-D-A-W-G.com. They have dog treats. They also have like raw dog food, raw beef hearts. They have tripe. Just go check it out if you are interested. Go look around, get some goodies for your dogs or cats and tell them Murphy sent you. So I'm gonna end the vlog here, but again, thank you so much Happy Dog for sending us these amazing treats. Go support them. Thank you Happy Dog, we love you so much and we will see you all next time. Bye. Murphy say bye. Bye.